Why you telling everybody that you know me? Motherfucker, I don't know you Why you telling everybody that we friends? They told me the shit you said Why you telling everybody that we down? Yo, 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 what's good everybody? Get off the couch, the show you hate to love This is episode 7 We got my homeboy, Mercules, he's on the show Thanks so much for tuning in we're gonna ask him a bunch of questions that you guys posted. Get off the couch page on Facebook. Picked a bunch of those. Go to stompdown.ca, you guys. Check out all the new videos Capital Q's putting out there. Stomp down killers. Always painting, always rapping, always getting live. So check it out on stompdown.ca. If you guys wanna look as good as the crew, you guys want some effing gear, effing.com, you guys. We ship that stuff worldwide. All right, so let's get started right now. We're gonna try and squeeze on the couch with him right now. See if we fit. Have a few beers, get these questions started. Ah, so let's get started with this. It's episode seven. Mercules, why don't you get up on the couch, homeboy? Yeah! <laughs> How you doing, homie? Not Good bad, to see you, man. man. Good to you? see you, man. You too, you too. Right up, oh. right. Right on, man. Uh, welcome to the couch, man. Welcome yeah, man. to the couch. It's pretty comfortable, man. Yeah, we're on here, right? We've got good uh, square footage here. We've got... Uh, Oh, yeah, yeah, this, uh, this, this is my homie Fingers, uh, a.k.a. Roadblock. A.k.a. Roadblock? What's that all about? Uh, well, Roadblock, because that, that's what happens when you try to come between me and him. <laughs> Snap, well, he's kind of making me nervous. You think, I think you're going to be all good here, man. We got this one, homie. I think he, I think he wants to. And we're all friends, man. We're all friends up here. It's all good. Okay, well now we got that out of the way. Can I get you a, can I get you a drink, man? Yeah, sure. What'd you, what'd you order? Classic. Like I'm a Classic. Little, I'm a little afraid to find it's out. It's like an old American car, bro. Let's see what you got for us today, Murky. Oh, oh, snap! Looks like we're getting dirty today. Brown bagging it, baby. <laughs> you had to, eh? Rolls look dirty. Very dirty. Let's get right into it. Here's Cheers. To episode seven. Thanks for coming out, my man. Thanks to everybody that uh, sent out their stickers too, to the effing shop. Got them, on the, uh, got them on the fridge before this episode. Anybody else wants to send out stickers, you know it'll be in the next episode. The next episode will be with To Be Announced. Got any ideas? Yeah, shout outs to To Be Announced. Okay, so why don't you tell everybody who you are? I'm Mercules, your mom's favorite fat kid, Baconators for breakfast, bacon over bitches. I'm 19 years old, residing out of Surrey, British Columbia. Representing Stomp Down Killers, effing apparel. Like I said, appreciate you coming out. Well, Spend the hey, time. Hey. What's you up? Just did cheers. You gotta sip back. Cheers. Jeez, oh, man, I'm getting schooled by Mercury Leaves. You uh, just let us know a little bit about what you've been working on. Latest hot crew, suitable ties. Like how long have you guys been doing that? Yeah, I've been uh, I've been working with my boys, uh, Prada West and Confidential, for a minute now. We've been together as a group for just a couple months now, uh, and uh, yeah, it's been going good. I'm gonna ask you a couple questions that we got uh, online. This is uh, from the Get Off the Couch page on Facebook. Uh, Mo Dirt uh, BSK. Yeah, How sure. did you originally hook up with Prada West and Confidential, and why did you guys decide to make a group together? Uh, big ups on the latest vid, sick track. Word. Um, with uh, basically. Suitable Ties is uh, basically, they're confidential and proud of West, both live on the island and they're from the island. And uh, I met them through another, a few artists that I knew on the island while we were out there doing shows on tour. Right. And I uh, started hanging out with Prada West and we, we eventually formed a group called Suitable Ties with Confidential. See, I met Confidential through Prada West. The reason why we're called Suitable Ties is because none of us knew each other. And right when we met each other, we instantly started making songs, making bangers. And that was our thing. It was kind of crazy because it was like we were all suitably tied together. That's why we're called Suitable Ties. I kind of think it's dope physically the way the three of you guys look on stage. Yeah, it's interesting. <laughs> well, you got you got skinny, confidential Prada West, who's all who's all beefed up and buff. Guy looks like a human pit bull. And then and then you got me, who's just just drowning in a pool of my own sweat every night before bed. You know what I'm saying? Zach Robinson, what made you choose to change your name from Merc Mikes to Mercules? That's an awesome question. About was I was on tour with Snack and Evil all the time. I've always been Merc before the rap. Before all the rapping, I, my nickname was Merc, and uh, eventually it was Merc Mikes because I started I started rhyming and whatnot. Mercules came about because I was on tour with Snack and Evil and Young Sin and D Rack and all those guys. I was always just the one that was always getting hammered, always just going hard. Just, 
basically like the, like obviously of the character Hercules, and they just started calling me Mercules, like Mercules. Right, you know, right. And I was always that dude that was always just just messed up, right? So it was one of those things, just being around. It was the a drinking name, and... honestly. It was at the end of the day, it was like my <laughs> drinking name. Put us to snack and evil and all those guys for coming up with the name. This album release, I mean, you got like a, you can give us like a rough estimate, like. I mean, at this point, it's been, uh, it's been a long time. I mean, I've been pushing this project. In the past two months, I've had so many opportunities come about that right, I feel right, like right. I had to take advantage of them, and I'd like to make them a part of the project. The legendary Razzcast, I got Jeremiah. Right. Uh, on a hook, I got Snack the Ripper, Evil Ebenezer, dope, all, dope. The, all the team members, I got Subs, I got uh, Lesk, Indelible, I got a whole bunch of crazy features on the album. So it's going to be a jam-packed album then? Like a good sound. So give me, you still haven't given me a date. Sometime June is what I'm pushing June -ish? for right now. June-ish? So give many, or take a solar year? So many what? opportunities <laughs> pop up out of nowhere. It's been crazy to see uh, what you have uh, put together online uh, with this contest that you put together. Suitable Ties as a group, we've been hosting this contest called the Who the Fuck Are You contest. Cats all over the world have to spit 16 to 32 bars over the three beats we provided in a YouTube video. We watch them all and we, we take note of what's going on and we have to pick our favorite 15. We announce our favorite 15 on April 5th. First place winner uh, receives features from all, all of Suitable Ties. They get a beat from Timeless of their choice. Timeless is produced for uh, Wiz Khalifa, wow, The Game. Lots of really big names, and uh, he he runs his own radio station uh, called Good Talk Radio. It's so they get radio airtime. They get radio play. They get a hot beat from somebody that's respected. Now this the is game, first place, and they get features from all of us. Yeah. That's first place. Yeah. Second place just gets a Mercury's feature and promotion on all our pages. Right on. And the third place winner gets uh, F and T, whole bunch of F and stickers. Right on. And you uh you you find mine. I say. Oh yeah 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 yeah. It's top fifteen material for sure. Top fifteen. Come on man. 200 entries, bro. I mean, I can only let you shine so much, you know what I'm saying? Guy Lewis, how did Mercules get those scars on his face? One time I was in the fucking, I was somewhere in Africa, and I fucking got under, tried tackling a lion one time. I was all drunk off this crazy African rum. No, he's asking for the true story. Oh, okay, well, see. <laughs> I get asked this question a lot. Uh, I was walking home from a party a couple years ago. It was New Year's, you know what I mean? Everyone's drunk. A car almost hit me. My buddy and our two girlfriends at the time, I told Buddy, slow the fuck down, watch where you're going. He took it the wrong way, got out, got in my face, started arguing with me, tried to swing on me, missed, so I punched him in the melon. Came back about five minutes later, two cars pulled up, one on each side of us, and a whole bunch of dudes jumped out. They grabbed their girlfriends, they tried to pull them into the car. They grabbed me, they batted me out, I hit the ground, I got hit with the bat, oh, hit the ground. I got cut with a switchblade, and then uh, I remember all I could hear was, he, he's done, he's done. And I looked and all I could see was like a big boot on my chest. I'm laying there in the rain. My buddy that was with me managed to get our girlfriends back and uh, he got he got stabbed through the hand and his back and his shoulder. It was just a really rough time, man. And uh, ever since then, it's just been music, music, music for me, bro. I would, haven't been such a hooligan since then. It's just been Dude, since. that is a gnarly story, man. Yeah, man, it was crazy. I, I, was gonna, I was gonna share the story about how I got this scar on my lip here. But I was just a kid, and I, that's hard body. Bro. I fell, I fell in the bathtub and put my my tooth through my lip. I don't really feel like telling that story anymore after that. Though. From from one rough man to another, mm, pound it. Oh, Mercules, this is the point in the show where I gotta ask you. What, what do you do when you get off the couch? Basically, I'm getting off the couch to go do a show or something. I got a show tonight, bro. Yeah. I actually got yeah. a, I got a I got a reservation on the the old ferry. Oh right, right on, right you know on. What I'm saying I, I know I, I know what that's all about. I mean I do this I do that all the time. I mean of I, course you're on tour. Bro. I you know I I'm basically out there just killing the game, killing the game. What's he say? Killing the game. Uh, rocking the beats. All smashing the time. Smashing the stage. Smashing the stage. Uh, just doing it all. Doing it all. <laughs> I'm pretty much pro. I mean. So I'm looking forward to it. I mean, if you want to take us out there, I mean, you know, like if you want to open up yeah, for man, me, we're, we're maybe you could open up for me. I mean, it's gonna be a good look for you. Okay, yeah, okay, I, okay. You you haven't heard my latest shit. I mean, I mean, okay. So maybe you've heard some of my older you know, stuff. Yeah, man. I was talking to Snack and Evil, and they showed me that record. Okay, that was, whoa, whoa, whoa. That was that was that was. Sixteen bars. My name's Craver. I got I got a lot of flavor. That you can savor. Let's not talk about it. That right, was right. just something that we I heard it. Talk That's about. all I need to say. Three words. I heard it. That is all. Right, all. Well, four words. I'm gonna rock the show That's tonight. That's five, bro. Those five words. And uh, I'm gonna rock the show. T That's six words. I'm basically I I'm as good as a rapper as I am a as a counter. So you can count on that, man. <laughs>
That's the other move I do. I'm gonna do that tonight when you open for me. Let's just do this. Uh, I'm getting, I'm getting excited. I, I gotta, I gotta get into my zone. I need to go into the bathroom uh, on the ferry and, and do that do thing where I put my hood up and I, I kind of like look in the mirror and I kind of do this and I, I scribble on a bro. sketch pad and. Uh, we and got we got C Rabbit in the building. And uh, I'm I'm gonna throw up a couple times, and then I'm gonna kill it. We're gonna hit Nanaimo. Uh, Murky's gonna open for me on stage. Uh, let's do it. Whoa 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 whoa. Oh, chill, what's, up? Chill, 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 what's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? You can't just be walking out. Oh, so. but this is uh, this is my show, man. Oh, fingers, oh, come oh. here, bro. Thanks. Oh, shut up, roadblock. Nah. Roadblock. Damn. All right, well we're gonna be heavily guarded for this one. Hey, guys, I'm Craver. You guys, you guys, I'm here to debut my my new raps. I don't I don't have an album. No, 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 no. Just let me. Just give me a chance. Just give me a chance, okay? And I'm gonna spit a few bars right now, okay? You ready? Okay, here it comes. I ain't a rapper. I just paint a lot. Yo, my name's Craver. I'm the one the crowd favors. I got that flavor, like a pack of lifesavers. Yo, I got that seeds, like, like pink. Yo, yo, bro, yo. You know how this is get off the couch, right? Well, right now, you should get off the stage. You got it, though. You can find me in the alley while you back in the club Type to rob, shooting steel, selling crack to the bums They feed for 16s, every rap is a drug Go ahead and talk like you tough and get slapped in the mug You probably couldn't even handle the smoke I'ma stuff them in the bag like packaging coke Got beef and your dad'll be yoked Pass me the rope, everything I do has to be dope Battle me, no Y'all are just a bunch of keyboard warriors I'm hitting the lead until I see no more of you Little league and I'm rooting for the majors The proof is in the flavor, the stupid Stupidest behavior. Oh, exhausted. Oh, yes. Oh, Q didn't drink this. Since he's a surprise. Flat as shit. That's why I stocked up. I've had six since last night. Did you have one for me? I got. It's your fault, bro. You left that one there. That was a long ass day, man. I'm glad that you were uh, able to, you know, hold your own after I, uh, you know, went up there and. I mean, I opened for you, but I mean, you know, I pretty much had the crowd in the palm of my hand. You want to answer a couple more questions? Let's do it. Marcus Schmilblick. Oh, that's, that's the homie, bro. That's it's Marcus Schmilblick. Schmilblick. Have you ever seen Craver's face? If yes, describe it without being mean. I've really never seen that. Craver's face. You never seen my face? Never, bro. I mean. I'm sure you've presented it, but I just never chose to look at oh, it. Oh, I've presented it. <laughs> Daniel Quavas, where's Waldo? He's at the crib right now, cooking me bacon. Oh, the flat OE is definitely uh, much more palatable than the uh, fresh cold one. I mean, Dude, I seen easy. you drink the ripper juice. That should not even be a problem for you. You're not a very good friend. Ian Penner, what is your favorite cereal? <sighs> Any kind with hot sauce. <laughs> you eat cereal with hot sauce? Look it up, man. Shit, fat kids say. YouTube, what up? At Aj Delator, who is the most annoying person in the world to you, Mercules? And don't say me. Caught me. Oh, Whoa. come on, man. We're buddies. I know, we're, we're buddies. Having a good time. Right, we, just, we just did okay. a show together. We rocked it. Yo, can I rock it? Can I rock it? Mmm. Remember? Rocking the show, slaying the dough, stacking up hydro. <laughs> <laughs> we got Levy Milani. Uh, can you sing a song about my name better than Evil E? That was pretty funny. Off camera I, earlier, you were you were hitting, hitting some the pretty high melodies, man. I could do there it like a go. share, done, like done. Levy Milani. <laughs> we're gonna do the uh, viewer question right now. You uh, you down to find out who wins the prize pack? Let's do it. From Jen O's, what would I find in your refrigerator right now? First of all, a couple of these for sure. Hot sauce, ketchup, mustard, 
Mayo, what, but eating condiments? I like the mayo that's squeezable. I don't like sticking the spoon <laughs> in there. You're not a white guy that eats mayo sandwiches, though, are you? Dude, I don't even need bread. I'll just eat the mayo. <laughs> All the stuff you can microwave, the chimichangas, right, right. the microwavable taquitos, mini pizzas, bagel bites, bacon, normal bacon, applewood, smoked bacon, turkey <laughs> bacon. I, I even fucks with the turkey bacon sometimes. <laughs> Last week's lasagna, you know what I mean? I'm all about the leftovers. Lots of meatloaf, mashed potatoes, more butter than potato. Birthday cake from like six years ago that I won't even touch because it's diabetic. <laughs> Half case of pep and cheds, a little bit of beef jerky. Hungry man, canned spam. Lunchables, baby bell cheese. We got some Dunkaroos here and there. Trying to slam some vanilla Coke, you know what I'm saying? I think that question deserves to win, bro. He or she, I'm thinking Jen owes, this is probably a she, eh? Uh, wins a prize pack. There's some uh, bunch of hand styles in there. A couple pins. Feel free to come uh, cook poster, me a pound of bacon anytime. Uh, Evil Ebenezer's latest album, The Birds. Uh, so good for you. We're gonna send that out. So this is the part of the show where I basically say, get off the couch, Merc. You wanna give me some assistance to get up? Yeah, here. Uh, you want a hand here? Here, I'll go like this, and then just get one of these, and then just kind of. Yep. Yeah. All right. All right. Ah. Oh, okay, homie. Hi, right, man. Thanks for having yeah, me, bro. Yeah, Talk safe travels. Uh, thanks for coming out, man. All right, so that was episode seven. Thanks so much to Mercules for coming out and spending some time with us. Um, all those questions came from the Get Off The Couch page on Facebook, you guys, so stay tuned on there. I'm gonna let you guys know the next guest. Post your questions, maybe get the viewer question, maybe win the prize pack. I wanna thank all the homies at Self Hired. Uh, they were a part of this episode and episodes to come. Uh, making it a real good look. Uh, so we're excited for the future. You guys stay tuned. So much more get off the couch to come. We're looking forward to it. I'm gonna take the rest of my flat OE right here. Uh, gonna get my ass off the couch. And until next time, peace out.